The, the laws of supply and demand would suggest that if we can increase, and we can use this tool to increase the, uh, the supply of these goods, then that'll help managing the, manage the price. Um, you know, we work with uh, 200 banks, global banks and local banks, to support trade. Since April 1st, we've done uh, over 1,000 transactions supporting $700 million in the trade of things like uh, test kits and, and commodities and uh, pharmaceuticals and, and medical equipment. And when this pandemic broke out, we contacted these banks and we said, hey, look, why don't you look at your client lists to see which of your corporate clients are involved in these critical supply chains? Um, and they didn't know. And so it was at that point that we thought, you know, hey, let's, let's look into this a little bit deeper. Uh, we contacted the healthcare sector and others to see if these kinds of maps exist so that we can identify these companies that are critical to ramping up supply. And, you know, they just didn't exist. So we were able to put this tool together to say we've made it uh, available on our, the Asian Development Bank website for free. And, you know, you don't need to sort of register or anything like that. The information is downloadable. There's a great search function in it. So you can search for companies by location or if you're a, you're a bank, you can see which of those companies are your, are your clients. And then we can contact these companies to understand what they need. Do they need more financing to support the ramp up of these products? Uh, you know, are there other things that they need? Um, so this tool provides all of us collectively with the opportunity to, uh, to do what we can to, to ramp up the supply uh, to fight this pandemic.